It's like opening a treasure chest of American history. RR Auction in Amherst is sharing the catalog of the John F. Kennedy collection going on the auction block. The finest, most comprehensive single collection of John F. Kennedy memorabilia and photographs ever put together. Opening bid is one and a half million dollars. The collector hopes this is purchased by a museum or institution, calling it an exhibit waiting to happen. There's photographs of him and his wife uh, at Cape Cod, the president and Jackie. And this is when he was at Harvard. He wrote a dissertation, golf balls you know, uh, that were used by the president. This collection is so comprehensive that it tells the story visually of John F. Kennedy's entire life, from the time he goes to grade school, learns to sign his name, going to war, uh, losing his brother, uh, being injured in the PT-109, running for Congress, Senate, running for president. Including his handwritten speech announcing his intention to run for president, dated January 2nd, 1960. Kennedy then launched his campaign for president right here in front of Nashua City Hall 60 years ago this month. A bronze statue marks the moment in history. It was January 25th, 1960. He stood in the snow addressing New Hampshire primary voters. He won 85% of Democratic votes in the March primary. He went on to win the White House in November of that year. John F. Kennedy's legacy and the whole Kennedy's family's legacy and, and presence is still felt here in New England. Bids begin now with the auction taking place January 23rd. In Nashua, Gene Mackin, WMUR News 9.